What's up, fight fans? Welcome to Triple THS, brought to you by Countermove Fantasy MMA at countermove.com. Select a game, pick a team of five fighters, score points, and win. That is how easy it is to play fantasy MMA. I'm the dial-up internet of mixed martial arts, Tommy Toehold. Today, the battle for the nachos goes down. Let's do this shit! <laughs> Fight fans joining me today are two men who are going to kick the shit out of each other this Saturday night. There's title implications, baddest fucking dude on the planet implications, and nacho implications. Johnny, you are looking a little rough. Well, Tommy, we're doing the weight cut, getting ready for Saturday night. You know, I cut about 250 pounds. So we've got to remove all the blood from my body. There's several limbs that get detached. It's a very scientific process. I know I look pretty bad right now, and to be honest with you, I cannot feel the right side of my body or my left pinky toe, but I promise you, I will be ready come fight night. Johnny, I am not a doctor, but removing all the blood from your body sounds like a very dangerous thing. Hey man, that's the sport, you know? What am I gonna do, fight at another weight class? That is certainly an option. Now, we changed my diet, and I really think it's gonna make all the difference. Let me tell you something, Johnny. You can call it what you want, but it's not gonna give you that victory. It's not gonna give you that title shot. And after I win, I want my damn nachos! Listen, Matt, we've been through this, okay? I don't have nachos for you. Oh, so what are you saying? You saying right now that if I go into your house, I'm not going to find cheese in the refrigerator? That I'm not going to find Tostitos in the pantry? I bet if I went in every house in the United States, Johnny, I'd find those two things. Then why do you need nachos from me? I don't understand. It's the principle of the thing, Johnny. Now make me some nachos. I'm not making you nachos. You might not make weight. All right, that's a pretty good idea, Johnny Hendricks. But I'm telling you right now, after those weigh-ins, but before our fight, I'm getting those damn nachos. Let's switch topics. Matt. You have been right on the cusp of a title fight several times now. Is this the time you finally make it over the hump? It's absolutely the time I make it over the hump. We let loose a Bengal tiger from the Cincinnati Zoo. He has been training with me this whole camp. He's actually part of my entourage. He will be walking me to the cage this Saturday night. He's actually here right now. Say something, Lord Ass Kicker. <laughs> That's what we named him. He says hello. Johnny, how do you see this fight going? You know what, man? We're both incredible strikers. We both got knockout power. We're both hard to put away. I think it's going to be a hell of a fight. I think it's going to go to a decision. And I think it's going to be a controversial one. Johnny, that sounds a lot like all of your fights since 2012. I'm just here bringing the fans what they want to see. Badass fights that end in such a way that nobody knows who won it. Yeah, that's real great, Johnny. And I'm sure we are going to have an exciting fight. But in all due respect to you, I don't think you realize what my shirt says. It says, I'm Matt Brown, so fuck you. And that's pretty much all I gotta say about that topic. So you feel like you're gonna win, Matt? Of course I think I'm gonna win the fight. What kind of stupid question is that? I'm Matt fucking Brown. A Bengal tiger is my best friend. I tell you what I think's gonna happen right now. John Hendricks is gonna come out. He's gonna hit me with one of those big old bombs of his. And once his hand connects with my face, he's gonna shatter into a thousand pieces. A thousand triangular pieces. And I'm gonna use those pieces to dip into my damn nacho cheese, Johnny! You know what? That's not even physically possible. So I, I don't wanna hear it. Is this fight gonna steal the show come Saturday night? It's not just gonna steal Saturday night. It's gonna steal Every damn card you ever saw, Matt Brown doesn't know how to get into a fight. That's not fight of the night. I got in an argument with a cashier at Walmart the other day, and Dana White came out and gave me $50,000 for it. Johnny, what do you think? Fight of the night? Oh, absolutely. I tell you what, man. There's not a douche and flop sim sim for sim flop sim are you okay, Johnny? What's wrong? That's nothing, man. That's that's just my that's just my weigh-in stroke. It happens. It it'll go away. It'll pass. Uh, all part of the weight cut process. You know, you, you just. You, 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 are you gonna be all right? It, it's just, I'm fine. I'm fine, guys. I'm the dying's part of the, it's part of the weight cut. My soul weighs like 0.5 pounds. Maybe we should wrap this up. Matt, final thoughts. Nachos. All right, that's show fight fans. Tune in daily for new content weekly on SB Nation and at triple THS.com so you can buy shit with my face on it. Right about triple THS. I'm Tommy Toehold. Those aren't the droids you're looking for.